Hello, I'm Ray DeVito, and I'm here with fellow comedian Josh Gondelman. And in honor of summer ending, we wanted to take a look at one of our favorite places on Earth, the unique and awesome Coney Island, right here in our backyard of New York City. The Mermaid Parade takes place at Coney Island every June, and it's like summer camp for Tim Burton characters. The Mermaid Parade is known for its crazy costumes. Here are some of our favorites. Now I can't tell if these people are even in costume or if they're just Williamsburg hipsters who wandered too far from home. The male seahorse actually has the babies, which may explain why this dude looks pregnant. This merman looks like a deleted scene from The Big Lebowski. Mermaid is an old sailor term. It means boobs. They're seashell boobs, octopus boobs, man boobs, dinosaur boobs, actual dinosaur boobs. And if you didn't decorate them, that's cool because this guy will paint them for you. One of the fun things is, is when you leave, it's still not over because you get to ride the train back with the entire freak show. And that is an hour long ride because that is how far away Coney Island is from civilization. This is David, the Puerto Rican kite flyer. It hurts me because he's the only Puerto Rican I know that does not have a Puerto Rican flag. Because this is the one time it is most appropriate to have one. Coney Island has its own minor league baseball team called the Brooklyn Cyclones. And thanks to global warming, that name is more accurate every year. There's a lot of awesome characters that always hang out at Coney Island. One person you can see is a Takashi Yamanada. He's the only dude that walks around on the beach in a suit. He's also the only person carrying a rabbit, slash duck, slash possum, and beads. There would be animals at this amusement park, but uh, I think they're scared of him. I'd like to take a moment to shout out Joey Chestnut, the seven-time winner of the Nathan's Hot Dog Eating Competition. His world record is 68 hot dogs eaten in 12 minutes. Joey Chestnut, my belt is off to you. After winning a hot dog eating competition, they make you pose with the number of hot dogs you just ate. How horrible is that? That's like winning a drinking contest and then getting 16 more shots of tequila. Joey Chestnut, as an American, we're all proud of you, but you're the last person I'm inviting to my cookout. Coney Island is home to a beard and mustache championship, which, if you've ever been to Brooklyn, it's kind of all a beard and mustache championship. Carnival prizes are so goofy. This corn has chest hair. It's like you're eating a Jewish guy. At night, Coney Island Boardwalk is one of the funnest places. It's like a Betty Ford clinic with the diversity of a college brochure. I admit, I like to drink, I hang out on the boardwalk with other boozers. That's how I got to meet the German version of uh, the drunk character Dennis Hopper played in Hoosiers, and this lovely mother of four. Anyone here have a pencil sharpener? I love how she's getting mad at him because he's hitting on her while she's dancing suggestively in front of a two-year-old. It's like a game of chicken, but with morals. All right, that is our video, everyone. Get out to Coney Island. They're open through Halloween. I'd like to thank Josh Gondelman. Follow us on Twitter. You guys are lovely. I hope to see you out on the boardwalk. Good night. Oh. <laughs> you guys suck, man. <laughs>